Good day. My name is Jean-Claude Tardif. I'm a cardiologist and the director of the research center at the Montreal Heart Institute and professor of medicine at University of Montreal. I want to review uh, with you the results of the Colcut trial, the Cochecine Cardiovascular Outcomes trial, uh, which were presented at the scientific sessions of the American Heart Association and published simultaneously in the New England Journal of Medicine. Colcut was a study of 4,745 patients recruited within the first 30 days after a myocardial infarction to test the hypothesis that reduction of inflammation with cochicine would reduce the risk of cardiovascular events after a heart attack. Colcut was coordinated by our coordinating center, the Montreal Health Innovations Coordinating Center, in Montreal, and I was privileged to be the principal investigator of that trial. The study was conducted in 167 hospitals in 12 countries. Patients were randomly assigned to receive either low-dose cochicine at a dosage of 0.5 milligrams once per day or placebo on top of standard of care. Patients could undergo percutaneous coronary intervention, PCI, for their heart attack if deemed clinically important. The results are very interesting in the sense that the primary endpoint, the composite of cardiovascular death, resuscitated cardiac arrest, non-fatal myocardial infarction, stroke, and urgent hospitalization for angina requiring coronary revascularization was reduced by 23% by the addition of cochicine versus placebo on top of standard of care. That result was statistically significant with a p-value of 0.02. Now we also looked at the total burden of ischemic cardiovascular event in a recurrent event analysis. Cochicine reduced the total burden of events, both first and recurrent events, by 34% compared to placebo, and that result was highly statistically significant as well. Cochicine was very well tolerated compared to placebo in this trial, and there was actually no significant difference in the incidence of diarrhea in both study arms in the 5,000 patients that we've, we've evaluated. So in conclusion, the addition of low-dose cochicine on top of standard of care significantly reduces the risk of ischemic cardiovascular events compared to placebo after a heart attack. We believe that these results have medical and societal importance. Cochicine is already widely available, is inexpensive, is orally administered, and can uh, be used immediately in our patients uh, with a recent heart attack. I certainly hope that once reviewed and approved by regulatory agencies, that all patients uh, that suffered a myocardial infarction uh, would be treated with cochicine and hope that cochicine will become the third pillar of treatment along with aspirin and statins uh, for the treatment of patients with vascular disease and specifically myocardial infarction. I thank you for your attention.